Hello everyone, my name is Alan from Al's Basketball Training and today I am going to show you a really good Horns basketball play from the Philadelphia 76ers. So hello everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Alan from Al's Basketball Training. If you're new, I post up basketball plays, drills, and skills. So if you like that stuff, hit the like button and subscribe. But basically, this was the Philadelphia 76ers game against the Knicks on Christmas Day. Here's something really quickly that I did on Christmas Day. <laughs> hey everybody, <laughs> let's do some drifting! What's up? Time for a drift, y'all. Anyways, I, I had a lot of fun. If you want to check out my cousin that, that was talking in that video or who took that video footage, uh, his name is Famous Bone on YouTube. He's a brand new YouTuber. He's going to be doing vlogs. So, yeah, go check him out. Link is in the description. But anyways, so uh, essentially in this basketball play, it creates lots of open three-point shots. So let's get down to the clipboard. I'm going to show you the play itself. And then from there, I'm going to be showing you the actual footage, and then we'll break it down into the two against the two-three and three-two zone defense. So first in this basketball play, we're going to have player four pop out, and player one will pass player four the ball. At this time, we are going to have player five setting a screen for player three, and player one setting up the staggered screen for player three as well. Player three is going to use that double screen or that staggered screen, and he's going to receive the pass. He may be open for a three-point shot, so he could be looking for that. But player two is going to go down to the low post where player four is going to set up a screen for player two. And two is going to pop out, and he should be open. He is the second option or the second opportunity for a three-point shot or a deep mid-range shot. Now let's go see the actual footage of the play, and then we'll show you this play against a 2-3 zone and a 3-2 zone defense. Okay, so here we have the 2-3 zone defense. Player 4 is going to pop out and receive the basketball. Player 2 is going to go and cover player 4. And we're going to have player 5 and player 1 setting up the staggered screen on player 3 for player 3. Player 3 is going to use that staggered screen. He's going to receive the ball. He could be open for the 3-point shot. Or what could happen now is now player 4 is going to set up the screen for player 2. And 2 is going to pop out and he may be open for the three-point shot as well unless player two red could recover in which case after every play that breaks down myself I personally instruct my team to go into the five out because generally as we see here they're pretty much at the five out already now let's go against the three two zone defense and see how this works okay so player four is gonna then pop out and he's gonna try and post his player up so that he's able to get that ball Next, we're going to have player 1 and 5 go and set the staggered screen for player 3. However, player 3 may be covered unless he takes the wide area so that player 1 is unable to guard him in time, in which case now he has the ball. We're then going to have player 2 go down to the low post. Player 4 is going to set up a screen. And now player 2 should be open for that 3-point shot. Now, this basketball play doesn't necessarily work all that well against a 3-2 zone defense. However, it does work really well against a man-to-man -man defense and a 2-3 defense. So if you have liked this play, let us know how you have used it with your basketball team, if you have, or if you've seen it run against your team, how you defended it. Anyways, if you have liked this video, hit the like button and subscribe, because I post these videos every single day. Anyways, I hope to see you guys tomorrow. Hello everyone, just a quick five second ad. Basically, there's a new thing called a community tab on YouTube. If you go to my channel and you click on the community tab, I put a whole bunch of different polls and stuff and you can comment. I ask a whole bunch of just silly, random questions. Maybe not silly, but interesting questions. Hello, so if you have liked this video, click over here to subscribe or maybe over here, depending on which side I put it on. 
I don't know yet. Anyways, uh, also, the opposite direction or the opposite side is another video you may like. So I hope to see you again in one of those next videos. Yeah.